Hello everyone, this is Amar Sonone. So in today's video, I'll be discussing about how to calculate the least count of vernier caliper. So before that, what is an vernier caliper? So vernier caliper is an instrument that is used for taking the external, internal and depth measurement of an object. So let's go to the vernier caliper principle. So what is the vernier caliper principle? So it states that the two different scales are there. They are constructed on a single known length of a line. So in vernier caliper, there are two scales. They are constructed on single known length of a line. And there is a difference between them that is taken for the fine measurement. So here you can see a vernier caliper. So there are two scales on that vernier caliper. So this scale is nothing but the main scale that is present on the beam. And this is nothing but the vernier scale that is present on the vernier slide. So this is the larger scale of the vernier caliper that is the main scale and vernier scale is the smaller scale of the vernier caliper. Now why this vernier scale is used? Because vernier scale will provide accuracy to the reading of this main scale. That's why we are using the vernier scale over here. So we'll calculate the least count of vernier caliper. Before that what is the least count? So least count of any instrument is nothing but smallest value that can be measured by measuring instrument. So that is nothing but the least count of a vernier caliper. A smallest value that can be measured by a measuring instrument is nothing but the least count. So here you can see an image of vernier caliper. So we'll calculate the least count of this vernier caliper. So least count is nothing but value of smallest division on main scale divided by total number of divisions on vernier scale. So value of smallest division on main scale. This is your main scale which is in mm. So the value of one division on main scale is one mm. So we taken this 1 mm and divided by total number of divisions on vernier scale. So this is your vernier scale which you can see over here. So total number of divisions on this vernier scale if you co count this division they are 10 in number. So we write 10. So if you count this so they are 10 in number on vernier scale. So 1 divided by 10 is nothing but 0.1 mm. So 0.1 mm is the least count of this vernier caliper. Means 0.1 mm is the smallest possible distance that can be measured with the help of this vernier caliper. So this is all about the least count of vernier caliper. See if there are 15 graduations on this vernier scale then what would be least count? Suppose if we consider 15 graduation then 1 divided by 15 will be your least count of this vernier caliper. Okay. So this is all about the least count of vernier caliper. Hope you like this video. Thank you for watching.